The U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin has taken responsibility for not disclosing his hospitalization to the top U.S. officials. The Defense Secretary is recovering from an unspecified medical concern and the Pentagon did not tell President Joe Biden and the White House about the hospitalization until three days. Now, the Defense Secretary said in a defense presser, and I'm quoting here, I understand the media concerns about transparency and I recognize I could have done a better job ensuring the public was appropriately informed. I commit to doing better, unquote. Now he's also expected to resume his official duties at the Pentagon soon. The news of Pentagon Chief's health came as a shock to the U.S. top brass and the Defense Secretary was hospitalized on the 1st of January. However, the National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan and other senior White House aides were unaware of this until the 4th of January. And reports also suggest that the Congress was informed just 15 minutes before the press release by the Pentagon. On Saturday, Pentagon's top spokesperson, Patrick Ryder, confirmed the recovery of the Defense Secretary. And the 70-year-old Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin comes right after President Joe Biden in the chain of command of the U.S. military. And as per a National Security Council member, President Joe Biden spoke with the Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin after finding out about his health concerns. And the President also echoed the sentiment of looking forward to the Secretary's return to the office. And separately, the former Defense Secretary under the Obama administration, Chuck Hagel, has pointed fingers at Pentagon's discretion. He has said that it was absolutely necessary for the defense body to let the National Security Council know of the matter. And he also added that it is especially important for the president to know about the whereabouts of his cabinet members at all times.